thing, the Timber Rattlers are welcoming back fans. For the first time in a year and a half, fans will be back in the stands for the season opener. Local 5's Faith Alfred is live in Appleton with the latest on opening day, Faith. Good morning, Shelly and Caitlin. That's right, the first season opener will be hosted since 2019, so this is an exciting season. I'm here with Chris Maring. How are you? Good morning, Faith. I am great. We have baseball season, and we're ready to welcome everybody home. Yes. Now, have you guys ever had to postpone an entire season before? No, never had an entire season before. Uh, last year was the first year without pro baseball in uh, Appleton and the Fox City since 1957. So we've, we've been a part of the community ever since. And uh, last year was tough, but we're looking forward to, to starting brand new tonight at 635. Yes, and I know you guys are excited. So tell us, what can fans expect? Well, right now, they can't expect to get a ticket because we are sold out for tonight. Mm -hmm. But those who have a ticket will be coming out. We'll have the Keston Here All-Fan Bobblehead giveaway. Um, we'll be doing that again tomorrow as well. But we'll have uh, socially distanced pod seating throughout the stadium. Uh, the concessions will be open. Uh, and just an opportunity to get back out here and, and maybe have a couple of beers with the, with the bats, uh, bat mugs down in the Bruise on 3rd area. Oh, that's exciting. Now, I know for sure for the Rattler staff, for you all, I know it's exciting for, to be back. How has that been for you guys preparing again and getting that energy back in the field? Well, it, it, we were getting, getting ramped up last year when everything got called off, and we took some time off, I think, and we were away from the stadium like everybody else. We were fortunate to be able to help out down in Fond du Lac last year. But, uh, you know, the last couple of weeks, it's just been full – Speed ahead, and uh, we can't wait to have everybody come back out to the ballpark. Yes, and at 6:35, are you guys going to be hosting any like, uh, I guess like performances, anything live happening, or else you guys are just limiting that? Uh, right Frankie Biscosco for, uh, will be uh, singing the national anthem before the game tonight. Unfortunately, we won't be have a lot, like we won't be able to do like first pitches or anything like that on the field due to some restrictions from Major League Baseball, but we will have a national anthem, and uh, that, she's done that for us a, a couple of times before, and it's always worked out great, and people are going to want to just be here uh, to, to meet the team and, and see some live baseball. Yes, indeed. Thank you, Chris, for joining us this morning. Live baseball is back. That's right. Um, so live in Appleton, Faith Alfred, Local 5 this morning. All right, thank you so much, Faith. And I know how many people are excited about this. We were talking about it in the newsroom this morning. Just to yep. get out there, hear the crack of the bat, watch a game. I know. Love that. And you are going to love that stadium. You're going to have to go see the Yeah, I've got to go. That'll be fun.